champion. World bronze medalist and has a World University Championship to go with it. He is looking for his fourth European Championships gold medal and fifth overall European if you include the games That's into incredible. that medal count. Incredible. Yeah. Them boys good. Let's see if we can get another Coming to America reference. That's been two today. Because my haircut was $8. I think you got ripped off, to be honest. Well, it's because I'm losing him. We've well, lost 30 seconds on the clock, but nothing doing other than testing each other's strength so far. Turkey against Azerbaijan, Akul, the man in blue. Wow, quick passivity yeah. offered 30, offered 40 seconds. Well, you know what? Not super fast, now that we think about it. It's just the, these two super good athletes, Act Gul 5 0 lifetime. Look at this strength as well. 5 0 against Magomedov in his career. So, and they really haven't been super close. Here you see Act Gul stepping over the leg, covering the hips. There's two. Uh oh. Uh oh. Here he's got his lace. There's two. He's going to try to keep him in. Can he try to go the other way? Head out of bounds. And that's when they stop it. When the head goes outside of the zone, that is when they stop it. So, takedown and two guts. This one could be. Uh, just a matter of simple mathematics. Should we get another takedown, Mr. Collin? Yeah, doesn't get paid for overtime. Well, because there is no overtime. That's why it doesn't get paid for it. At goal, six to the good with that leg lace, as you said. Can he convert again here? Magomedov up against it in this, the last final of day number three. At goal, just taking his time. Taking the steam off it a little bit here. Oh, heavy snap. I mean, you're snapping a guy down, it's 125 kilos. That's, and it makes, he made it look easy. Like, and consistently oh. as well. I mean, heavy hands, heavy arms, heavy heavy forearms, heavy head, just thump. I mean, if he snapped either one of us down, we'd be through the bottom of the mat. Heavy weighs the crown. But who's going to take the heavyweight crown here? Akul in prime position. Magomedov bereft of ideas, just stepping back, gets the single leg, go, good attempt, can he get round the back? He can. Wow. Can he get a little gut wrench as well? Take an exception to my math problem. He says, no, nope, now it's down to four. I can score on this guy. Good work from Magomedov. He mentioned the head-to-heads that they've got, so maybe he's taken something from that. Maybe he's thrown caution to the wind here. Could be the, the wind of change, perhaps. Um, five and zero, oh, and they've really not been amazingly competitive. They've been—I mean, you can say they've been close bouts, but Akul has really has the ability to once he locks up that leg lace or a track arm, he is deadly proficient with it. So uh, we won't see it in the rest of this period because we're in short time here at the end of the first. But that—that uh, that is his parterre scoring preference is that, that dangerous leg lace. And that's one thing, though, we've talked about how that's the most dangerous move in wrestling throughout the course of the week. We really haven't seen it in our medal matches as much. We haven't seen really anybody lock it up, go boom, 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 boom. And throughout the course of the tournament, I really haven't seen that much either. Is that a case of, you know, canceling each other out, quality against quality? You're not going to give up that you know, right position? This was it, what we're it, talking about here. Yeah. Some of it might be just because uh, I come from the United States and I see how quickly athletes over there have, have gone the lace to try to end matches. And, uh, you know, the variety of techniques aren't that difficult. It's maybe just the preference of the coaching staffs or the, the nations that wrestle a specific style that, that may say, okay, the lace in that situation isn't their preferred. Maybe they're more trap arm guts. Maybe they're just proficient rather throwing you on your head. But uh, Akul definitely is a guy that likes to use the, the ankle lace to, uh, Deadly, deadly. That scorpion like strike that he's got as he sneaks around the back again. Another two, perhaps. Has he got a good grip for this gut wrench? Does he like to stand? Can he get his legs out? Well, it looks like he's just kind of taking a, taking a breather down there. Didn't look like he tried anything yep. from the top position. Extends his lead back to six points. 29 seconds into our final period of freestyle wrestling here in Novosad, Serbia.
with John Cullen, who's been our lead man all week. Jason Bryant here with you. Spins Sports Center, and there's a whole lot going around this place than just sports, I can tell you that. There is everything this facility's got, so. Yep, entertainment on and off the mat, but it's not entertaining reading at the moment for Magomedov. He's six points down, just about two minutes, and some change to try and get something going here at goal. And he's always in that on-guard position. He's straight in there. But he's been made to work for it, Magomedov, here. He doesn't want to go for the silver medal, but you would fancy Atkel, who just squats down, surveys the landscape, and it's happy reading at the moment for the Turk. Passivity potential here, the referee having a close look. Akul, will he take a warning? Is there enough time for Magomedov to do something here? Akul just separates from that strength that we talked about. Endurance is clearly there as well. Akul also just sitting here going, hey, if you want to you win this match, you've got to come to me. He's standing in the center. Squatting in the center. Lowering his level. He, he makes his, he shrinks his target. Sweep attempt there by Magomedov. Difficult for Magomedov. As you said, shrinks the target, but the time is shrinking away as well for him into the last 30, more or less now. Magomedov looks like a silver. Akul looks like a gold, but we've seen a reversal of fortunes before. The only thing we can say for sure, these heavyweight men have produced an athletic contest. That lean power and strength, plus the tactics and timing of Atgul. And he is going to claim the European Championship gold medal here. Magomedov gave all he had, the Aziri. But it's a great goal for Turkey. Never in doubt, Jason. 6-0 all-time against Akgul, now five European titles if you include the games and the championships to go along with his Olympic gold and his, his two world titles. So uh, one of the best wrestlers in the world.